Hi friends, in this video we are discussing homogeneous function of degree n for the three independent variables. Coming to the definition, a function f of x comma y is said to be homogeneous function of degree n if it should satisfy any one of the following conditions. First one, like for two variables what we are done, same thing we are doing. Like in place of x we are writing ax. In place of y, ty, and in place of z, kz, we are substituting. Then we have to get f of kx, comma, ty, comma, kz will be k to the power of n, f of x, comma, y, comma, z. Then you can say the given function of f of x, comma, y, comma, z is a homogeneous function of degree n. Now, second form. If given function f of x, comma, y, comma, z is said to be homogeneous function, you can also express in terms of x to the power of n into pi of pi x comma z by x. In this case also you can say homogeneous function of degree n in three independent variables. Now, third form. If the given function f of x comma y comma z is said to be homogeneous function of degree n, if I take an y comma then you will have y to the power of n into pi of x by y comma z by y. Now, fourth form. Given function f of x comma y comma z is said to be homogeneous. Here we are taking z is a comma. Then z to the power of n into pi of x by z comma y by z. Then you can say this function is homogeneous function of degree n. So friends, remember if the function is said to be homogeneous of order n or degree n we have to prove any one of the following conditions similarly for two variables also the next video we are discussing euler's theorem and uh, some of the problems on uh, euler's theorem thank you for watching this video